What is up guys, I'm Brett HD FIFA and today I'm bringing you the Liverpool legends of my kind of squad builders. As you know over the past week I have been bringing you different kind of legend squads, uh, different winning squads, different cup squads and stuff like that like the United, um, I think it's 081 or something like that. Um, I, I brought you the Liverpool 05 Champions League one against AC Milan and stuff like that really. Um, I just want to say before this video, I'm really sorry if you can hear any uh, kind of like music in the background of this video. That is because my next door neighbour is playing their music very very loud and it's very very frustrating and I'm getting really annoyed with it and I'm really ready to rage uh, because obviously yeah, as you can most probably hear that, that is really, really loud. And um, it's going to be different, like, it keeps on going up and down, depending on the music. And it's really, really frustrating me trying to do commentaries, because I'm trying to do a lot of commentaries today, and it's been playing all day, and it's really made me have a really bad headache. So, yeah, I'm sorry if it's in the background, and I hope you enjoy this video. So, yeah, first of all, we got Ray Clements in goal. Obviously, this is not the right player. This is kind of the names, because obviously, this is kind of ranging from the 1960s to kind of the present time now, as you can see with Gerard, Xavi Alonso, Danny Murphy, and Michael Owen, and Jamie Carragher. So, ah, uh, ball sack. Uh, so, <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. So the first goal, first play, player we have is Ray Clements. He was a goalkeeper, started his career in 1967 with Liverpool. He did actually start his career with Scumthorpe in 1966, played for them with, in, with, uh, for a year, uh, joined the Reds for 18,000. Uh, Bill Shankly was the one that actually spotted him and he played after he joined Liverpool he played 470 games it didn't score a goal but well with goalkeepers you can't really blame him um, he did get an MBE as well after playing for them so yeah next player is Emlyn Hughes uh, he joined Blackpool in 1964 played with them for three years only got 28 appearances but then joined Liverpool in 1967 uh, played with them for 12 years and uh, he got 474 games played and 35 goals. So obviously a, a, quite a decent player there. So, um, he was kind of like a, a centre-back and a left-back as well. So kind of like changing between two positions. Next we have Jamie Carragher who obviously still plays now for Liverpool. Uh, being a very, very solid defender all kind of his career. Obviously getting a bit older now, he's getting a bit slower. And he's going to be getting a bit worse because obviously he can't keep up with the faster, uh, like, pacier players in the Premier League now. He started his career in 1996, 482 games, three goals, and many own goals, I must admit. But who cares about if he scored own goals? He's been a very solid defender for Liverpool and a definite, definite legend in my eyes. So next we go on to Mark Lawrenson. He, he actually played for two different clubs before he actually played for Liverpool. So he weren't exactly like a youth player. He only played for them for seven years in 1981 to 1988. He only played 241 games. Uh, he only scored 11 goals at centre-back. Um, but I still think, I still, in my opinion, he is still kind of a legend. Uh, even though he hasn't played that many and didn't start off the career at them, he did do a very, very good job for them indeed. Um, I kind of messed up on this. I forgot to buy the actual player. So, yeah, I'm sorry about that. But I've actually got the player that I need. So, that is actually Alan Kennedy. Uh, he did start at Newcastle in 1972. 158 appearances. And then, in 1978, he moved to Liverpool. Um, he played with them for seven years with 251 appearances, 15 goals at right back. And, in my opinion, that is a very, very good... Um, no, well, I think that might have been a left back or right back, one of them. But that is a very, very good record for one of them anyway. And he was a very good player. Next, we have... Let's just go on to him. Kevin Keegan, as all of you will know, he has been... In my eyes, he is one of my favourite ever kind of players. Um, kind of one of my favourite ever managers as well. Because, uh, as many of you know, I, I support City. And he obviously came and managed City and... Kind of like, he's, he's managed a lot of teams, played for a lot of teams as well, but he was just a legend. And with Liverpool, he definitely showed that 230 games, uh, 68 goals, nine, he joined in 1971, only played for them for six years, left on 1977, but still, he was an absolute legend, and I love him to pieces. So next, we're going to go on to Danny Murphy. Obviously, he plays for Fulham now. He joined in 1997. He uh, left in 2004. He only played 170 games, he scored 25 goals, but he was a definite rock in that midfield for them. Uh, next, I don't think he's actually been counted as a legend as of yet, but definitely in my... Uh, actually, I'm going to go on to this one next. I'm going to leave the one I was about to just say, actually, to in a bit, actually. So, John Barnes, um, 18, 1987 to 1997, he played 314 games, 84 goals. That is an absolute amazing record, really. Um... He was a very good player, and obviously he doesn't play anymore. But 
I, I think he's played in the Masters a uh, few years ago and well in my opinion he hasn't really lost it I still think he's got it and he looked very good in my eyes uh, the Liverpool fans love him and I think they always will so next we're going to come on to Xavi Alonso who obviously uh, didn't start his career at Liverpool but the time that he was at, uh, kind of with Liverpool for five years he played 143 games 15 goals but they, he was kind of their rock in that midfield and got them so many wins uh, obviously not just for scoring, he only scored 15 goals, but in my opinion he was an outstanding player. He he was fizzing the ball, always keeping that midfield intact, with, side by side with Gerrard, was unbelievable player in my eyes. Right, next we have Steven Gerrard, um, obviously a boyhood Liverpool fan, 1998 he joined them, 401 goals and 18, um, 401 games and 89 goals and oh wow, um, a definite, definite legend. Liverpool fans absolutely adore him. The same with Michael and the same with Carrigan, the same with Xavi Alonso. Every fan loves him. And he just, he's unbelievable. Obviously, a few years ago now, obviously, he's been getting a few injuries lately. But he was an unbelievable. It was outstandingly weird how, like, the ball would just come to him and you'd just see him ping it straight into the back of the net. The kind of the last memory I see of kind of him when I was a youngster really was um, the Steven Gerrard. I think it was versus West Ham in the 90th minute at Wembley, and the ball just came out to him and boom, straight in the back of the net. And what a goal that was! So in my eyes, a definite legend again. So now we come on to the last player. Well, on my proper team, uh, we have Michael Owen. He joined in 2004, only left in 2000. No, ball sack. He left in 2004, joined in 1996, 216 games, 118 goals. So it's kind of like one, one to one, one to two ratio. Every two games he scores a goal. So very good indeed. Uh, all the Liverpool fans definitely loved him indeed. And yeah, he was a very good player. I don't really remember him playing because it is quite a few years ago now. But yeah. So now we come on to the manager, who's obviously Den Kenny Dalglish. <coughs> Played a very good uh, a lot of games for him. Obviously, his nickname is the King, uh, King Kenny, as many of you will know. And he is a very good player indeed. Well, was not anymore, but yeah, he mostly says and lost it. Uh, last player is Heskey. I haven't got any stats for you, but yeah, this is the player. He he. Well, I don't know if he is counted as a legend for them, but he played for him and he was he was a right player. He was scoring the goals when they needed him. And yeah, so um, the goals will be coming any second now. If you like this video, guys, please like, favourite, comment and subscribe. Um, there'll be a few goals. And uh, just comment what teams you'd like me to do next. I've got a few good ones coming up. Uh, yeah, so see you later, guys. Please like, favourite, comment and subscribe. And peace out in a bit, guys.